sub the channel. I'm doing a PS5 giveaway. I do game on this channel. I'm doing the PS5 giveaway. It's still going on. It ends next Friday. Thank y'all love, man. And you know, coach, man. Go ahead, like, subscribe. Click it at the bottom. Thank you. How you doing, man? This is NL Coach, man. Coming here with a little crypto talk, man. I've been seeing a lot of people try to figure out how to do this. And uh, I believe I figured out the easiest way, the easiest method to go ahead and go get safe moves. Some I invest in. I've been uh, kind of dabbling and dipping in the crypto market since early 16, 2016. Uh, quick little story. I used to do the gambling on Bovada. And they actually paid you in Bitcoin. So this is how I started in the crypto world. But in itself, you see here we have Pro Big Global. This is something you have to. This is one of the exchange that I found that helps you actually get safe moon easier. And I'll go through and I'll show you what I mean by this. So if you don't have an account on Pro Big Global, you're going to have to either take some BTC, some Litecoin, or some Ethereum. Right now, Ethereum gas prices are super high. Anything on the Ethereum network is super high right now, so you're gonna have a different fee. Um, this is like a couple of days ago when I did it, and I did it before then uh, on my Safe Moon account. So just remember, you're gonna have high gas prices exchanging. So uh, you want to exchange it to your ProBit Global. You don't need to have your card information on here. You want to go buy your crypto at another crypto exchange. I got Coinbase, I use uh, I believe Bismart, and uh, I also use Binance. It's kind of hard to use Binance, but if you learn how to use it, there's videos on that, you can use Binance. So you have to go to the ProBit Global, it's an app, or you can do it on the browser. You wanna deposit your crypto, like I said, I use Bitcoin. I would say to get the safe moon, uh, when I tried to deposit under $100 to buy it, it wouldn't let me purchase it for some reason. So make sure you have over $100 after you do your transfer. So after you do your transfer, you wanna add your Bitcoin, then you wanna trade your Bitcoin to USDT or Tinder, whatever you wanna call it, whatever you wanna call it. So you wanna change your actual Bitcoin to Tinder. This is how you go ahead and transfer it over to the Binance coin. And this is why I say this is gonna get a little tricky. And I did it like this twice and it worked. So I know some people that go through and they ex certain exchanges on the wrong exchange code and you can lose your money as possible but i did this twice i actually tested it five times with smaller coins and it went through but i did it twice with over a hundred dollar transactions and they also went through so you want to transfer into the binance coin after you get usd tender so after you get that i'm going to show that as well on here i sold it i got the amount the amount wasn't filled because if you re so remember Sometimes it won't sell because the prices fluctuate. So you want to go in there and you just want to buy what you can real quick because you're trying to get the USDT. Don't worry about how much Bitcoin you lose. Let's say you lose two or three dollars of Bitcoin, it don't matter. You want to go in there and sell to get the field amount because you want to transfer it in to the Binance coin. So this is why you want to continuously do it. Like I say, any coin that lets you transfer it, like how you see I'm just going in, I'm just buying it. I don't care what the order is. I'm, I don't care about the market price. I don't care how it's fluctuating. I'm just going in and buying it. I don't care. And then you want to do your transaction history. Once you see everything filled, you have everything filled and you change it into USDT. USDT tender is how you buy safe more. You have to transfer it into there, then switch it to the Binance coin. Like you see, I, I, I see the Binance coin being sold. I'm, I'm just going to buy it real quick. I don't care about the price. I'm not trying to get a... A, a, a good return on it. It don't really matter. I'm just buying it. You see, I'm just buying it just to get it down. I, honestly, you don't care. This is what I'm trying to tell you. Don't try to make money real quick by doing this because you're getting a safe moon. And safe moon itself helps you make money once you use certain wallets. So I use the trust wallet. Safe moon helps you. In all essence, when you buy safe moon on the trust wallet, you actually make money from buying it on the trust wallet. I know it's two other wallets. I don't know about those. But I am reading about those to try to figure out how much you actually get a return back on that one versus using the trust wallet. So I'm just going in there and I'm just buying up the Binance coin. Don't matter. Just buy whatever you, I buy the 12 cent, then I buy the dot. I just buy it. I, I don't care. Like I say, you want to get the amount you can get to move the safe moon 
And I would say at least have $100. I would say $125 deposit because when you do the transfers, they have their fees and everything. So at least have $125, $150. Any, anything over $125, you straight. And I will say this when we get over to the Safe Moon Exchange, I'll tell you that I did some of my first purchases of Safe Moon that actually worked. See, I'm just buying it. I don't care. I'm not trying to make a return. I honestly don't care. I just, yes, I, I clicked the wrong one at that time. But make sure you're doing 100% every time. You don't, it doesn't matter if you market, do the market transaction on this one because you're just trying to get it. It doesn't matter. Now we go check and you actually see the transfer of balances I got. And this is what, like I say, right here, in this exchange, in this exchange, they let you switch the Binance coin when you're withdrawing. They let you switch it to the smart chain. You need to switch it to smart chain. This is what you need to do. You need to switch it to smart chain because that's what you want to exchange it into. I don't know why you can't use a regular Binance to buy it, but even when you go into Safe Moon into the Trust Wallet, you have to switch in the Trust Wallet. So this is cutting that step out. I'm going to show you what I mean. I'm exchanging it into the Binance. I, I click the numbers that really don't matter. You know what I mean? Like, it don't matter. I'm, I'm exchanging what I have that was in USDT. Now, I'm exchanging that. And I'm sending that there. So once I send that there, I already have this amount of safe moon. And like I say, when you use the safe moon and you have it, it actually builds up on its own in the account inside the trust wallet. So you, every time somebody sells Safe Moon, uh, any any transactions with Safe Moon, the trust wallet sends you Safe Moon back. So as you can see, my actual Safe Moon is going up. Just sitting there, it goes up on its own. I haven't broke down the percentile that it go up, but it goes up on its own just sitting there in the wallet. That's another thing. I bought Safe Moon at a uh, point zero 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 three i believe i think it was five zeros or three and then it popped up to um point zero 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 eight or zero nine so just off that and i like i say i think i only did uh two deposits maybe over a hundred dollars and i already made four five hundred dollars off of it just just like that just because it increased so like I say, it automatically switch. And I'm showing you right now. I'm going to go back. It automatically switch. You see it sent. This exchange, ProBit Global, lets you send Binance Smart Chain. You don't have to exchange it inside here anymore. You can just automatically send it so you can cut that step out and make it easier. This is why I say this is the easiest way to do the safe one. To me, I found this out and I did it every time. It's clean, smooth, and easy. This is the easiest way to do the safe mode. You can send it directly as a Binance Smart Chain from ProBit Global. It allows you to change the tender. Once you buy the Binance and you want to withdraw to send it to your trust wallet, it will automatically exchange it for you. Not a problem. As you see, the Smart Chain has entered my account, so it did not miss on the transaction scene. I did this five times with small coins. I did it twice with large amounts and all of them went to the trust account. It worked. So instead of doing the Binance switch here, you can do it inside ProBit Global just by withdrawing it and sending it to your trust wallet. So I cut that step out. And after you do that, you take the rest of the steps as I told you before. You see, I had the errors because I didn't know that I can do that. And I was trying to just do straight Binance. So I didn't do Binance, I did the Binance chain. That's why I was having the errors. And I wasn't sending the correct amount. So the slippage tolerance level, you can do 12, excuse me. You can do 11.5 and up. You can choose. I did 12 this time, cause I didn't realize that I could do 11.5 and up. Cause when I was doing those errors, I thought it was a slippage tolerance and it wasn't. It's that I, I sent Binance instead of sending the Binance chain. And it was doing it incorrectly because I wasn't putting the correct amount in. When I was doing here, right here on the exchange, I wasn't putting the correct amount in as the max. Because it was under $100, like I was telling you. You have to have over $100 to do the exchange. Anything under $100 for me did not work. 
I don't know if it's because of the transaction fees or what. But anything on the hundred dollars didn't work. That's why I kept having the errors that you've seen before. Once I got over 110, 120, it just went through. So I'm going to, anytime I'm going to buy safe moon, I'm going to change my slippage back to 11.5. Anything on 11.5 does not work. So now you exchange a safe moon, you type in safe moon, click it, slippage fees. Like I say, then it goes through. Like I said before, this is the easiest way that I've seen to get safe moon now. The easiest way I've seen. You go through, you switch it to Binance Chain on ProBit Global. Now, if any other exchange has that option, you can do it on any other exchange, but I haven't seen that. Every time I go to exchange, I only have the Binance to switch to Binance when you withdraw. This one allows you to switch from Binance to Binance Chain inside of the same app before you send it to your trust wallet. This is why this is the easiest way. Boom, sent. That's what I'm telling you, it works. It was able to switch within the wallet during the withdrawal. That's why this is the easiest way. So you go back to your trust wallet, then you sit, boom, bounce right back up. I just sent the 140, it took me to one, I think I was at 780, took me up to 900 some dollars, like I say. I've already had an increase on here, an increase 0.734% right now when I did this, but when I first had my first increase, my first increase was like 25 percent on, on like a $200 investment, which bumped it all the way up to $700. So I, I probably made five, four to $500 just off the first investment when it was low. And like I say, you might want to get in here. There's a few other things I got in here y'all seen. Bonfire, BTT, um, Dogecoin, as you seen, I do Doge too. Uh, these are just the small altcoins I got. You can see it went through. Then I have an exchange problem with going through once it was withdrawn from ProBit Global and switched over through the Binance change on that account. They did, it, like I say, it was received. I'm just showing everything, showing it was received, showing you it went through. It was not a problem. It was exchanged on its own. Like I say, if you want to get safe moon, if you're attempting to get safe moon, this is what you got to do. So I'm going to go ahead and pause and end it here, man. It's your boy in there, coach. Like I say, Go to ProBit Global, the exchange. It's an okay exchange. I wouldn't say it's the best like Binance, but it's an okay exchange. It did go down when the uh, Dogecoin was going on. I heard a lot of exchange went down. Like I say, I'm really jumping into the um, into the actual crypto world, like I say in itself. I'm really jumping into it, really getting it. But this is the easiest way I found to make safe more, man. Appreciate y'all. Go ahead and sub the channel. I'm doing a PS5 giveaway. I do game on this channel. I'm doing the PS5 giveaway. It's still going on. It ends next Friday. Thank y'all love, man. And you know, coach, man. Go ahead, like and subscribe. Click it at the bottom. Thank you.